What's up, y'all? My customer said she wanted something smaller to fit on her patio. If I got an air tank, come on, let me show you how I build it. So first, we're going to cut them little feet off. It's a little rubber stopper on the bottom, so we're going to use those again. Once we get them cut, we're going to make the first cut up top, grind off, and wedge your hinges on. When cutting out your door frame, you want to let the corners cool down. If not, it'll make your door buck up on you. Little tank was clean. So with my door stoppers, I weld in some two inch angle line right behind my hinges. With the lips, you want to kind of curve those before you weld them on. So it'll sit flush against the tank. You don't want no air getting in and no smoke coming out. Both sides. You put your front one on and you good to go with the door. So with my wheels, I used a half inch pipe with a three eighth inch rod and weld it. Two washers on each side. Shit, it worked pretty good though. Make sure it's sitting even. And we're gonna take those same feet that we cut off, put them right under there. Sit perfect. With the handle, I use a regular trampoline spring and a half inch square tube and box it up, weld it on. You know the vibes with the dump. Had to wash it out a couple times though. I had to get them right. With my arms, I measure from the back of the barrel to the front of the door. It's 15 inches. So you want to kind of cut that at an angle so it'll sit right flush against the barrel. Once you get those welded on, you measure from each side to side. It was an 18 inch gap, so I made my rack 17 and a half just so they'll slide good. We're gonna grind them off 